Morning guys, so just to give you an idea of how I camp, yeah, yeah, cute right? This is the birdhouse, close to one of the very popular state parks out here. <laughs> I wanted to get an Airbnb, I did not want to camp. My parents have our kids at Fall Creek Falls and excited to do some hiking today, but that's not why I'm here with you today. While I know this is kind of funny, I'm sure some of you relate. You probably don't like to camp either, so stop laughing at me. Had a good night's sleep in a regular bed. Pretty sure it was a pillow top. So, you know, you go ahead and hate. Um, we prayed together last night, and that's what I'm going to encourage you to do. Even if you're not married, um, you can still pray to yourself, right? And if it's not prayer that um, makes sense to you, then think of something, think of all the things you're grateful for in your life, grateful for in your marriage, grateful for with your kids, um, what you hope for in the future. Um, I just, I think that if we, I'm kind of feeling like I need to put out a challenge. I'm kind of feeling like this is a call to action vlog today, life episode. Because I think that if we just try it once, We'll see, you know, we'll see a benefit to it. It'll feel good. We'll sleep good. But I feel like, let's do it for 30 days. Do you guys want to do that? We did this before with the drinking water thing. And nobody really uh, kept me apprised of how they were doing. One person did. My friend Nancy did. And she did a great job. She said she was in the, in the toilet a lot. But I think we need to do this. There's, there's no repercussions other than, um, well, other than I think a full mind and a full heart that um, there is so much in our life already that we can be thankful for and um, so many more things that we can be hopeful for because remember we're living for gain not for what we could lose okay so I'm gonna challenge you for the next 30 days pray with your husband and if you don't pray then tell him why you're thankful for him tell him what you're excited about in your life and the other way too your husband can tell you, okay? And then for you singles out there, just think of all the things that you've been given. Just think of all the things you're grateful for. Again, the same thing and what you hope for. Um, I think that it'll be a good exercise. It'll keep your mind focused on the, um, the positive that's already happened, but also moving forward, if you keep focusing on what you want, what you hope for, it's a good chance it's gonna happen. So. That's what I'm gonna encourage you to do today and every day for the next 30 days at least, and hopefully we create a habit here, okay? Take care.